so I thought I'd do a few more KMAP examples for you. So in this example, I've gone ahead and taken my truth table or expression and transferred it into a um, four variable KMAP. And now I'd like to make groupings to do my simplification. So let's look at the groupings here. I don't have any eights. I don't have any isolated or any 16 either. But there are a lot of variations of four here. So I'm going to use a couple of different colored pens then to show you maybe how some of that works. So here's a group of four that I see immediately. Now this is a group of four here or it's a group of two there. So if to get it in a group of four to get the greater simplification we have to overlap the fours we will. We wouldn't overlap them if they were both in already in groups of four. So then here is another group of four. And now here is yet another group of four. So let's look at what some of these terms are. This term, for instance, is not a B because C and D change as I move through here. This term is CD because as I move here, both A and B change. This term is going to be D because as I move from here to here, C changes. And not A because as I move from here to here, B changes. So not A, D. Right, and then I still have some other terms I haven't taken care of yet. So let's go ahead and get them into groups. So I'll make a group here and a group here. And so now I have for this group, I have B, C, not D. And for this group, I have B, not C, not D. Okay? So, as I write that expression, it would look like this. Not AD, or CD, or not AB, or... B, not C, not D, or B, C, not D. As I look at this, I think these are very simple terms, but there seems to be something very much in common about here, and I have to ask myself, did I make a mistake? All right, so let's look and see. I have... B, not C, not D, and B, C, D, not D. Just thinking about my Boolean, I could factor out B, not D out of that term, and I would get not C or C. And not C or C is always 1, right? So that would make that term B or not D. So since there was a further simplification, there's something wrong with my K map. So as I look at this, and you may have seen it initially, and I kind of did it intentionally, remember that the K-map wraps around this way. So you can roll it up that way, or you could roll it up this way, and they're in contact, which means that this is a group of four with this piece. Which, if we look at it that way, we get rid of these terms, right? Now that group will become what? Not D and B. So in fact, the expression is not A, D, or C, D, or not A, B, 
or B, not D. So I hope that helps you, and I hope it um, you can feel a little more comfortable with K-maps.